Hi YouTube, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Kat and I really appreciate you taking the time out of your day to join me um, in talking about all things beauty. So I'm going to go ahead and get started on my little Mother's Day surprise that my hubby um, gave to me. He actually took me in store and let me pick out a few fragrances. So I was super, super happy. Um, and they came in these cute little boxes this is how they gifted them to me. Well, they didn't gift them to me, but they wrapped them up in those. My hubby gifted it to me. And the first fragrance that I got is Nova, Angel Nova by Mugler. So this one comes like this. Isn't she gorgeous? She's so pretty and she smells so great. I'm actually gonna spray it on the box. Like when you smell it, it smells kind of like grapefruit, but then you smell the raspberry and it reminds me of Sunkissed Raspberries from Bath and Body Works. It is so nice. Like, I didn't even think they were capable of making a perfume like this. Like, cause Alien had to grow on me. But this one, it is, it's nice. It's worth at least trying in a rollerball. Cause I think once you try it, you'll be like, I need that. So that is Angel Nova. And I can't stop looking at the packaging. I love it. Pink, beautiful. <laughs> The next one um, is the original perfume that my husband was going to get for me. Um, but since I'm so picky with my fragrances, it's just something you just, I've learned my lesson from blind buying. Um, so this is the whole point of even going in the store was just to get this one. I ended up getting four, but neither here nor there. Um, so it's the Jimmy Choo. I won't chew. <laughs> That's so funny, I don't even know the name of it. It's so cute. But this, look how stunning this packaging is. So this is how this one looks. So feminine, so beautiful. It reminds me of like a J-Lo type thing. But this is not J-Lo, this is Jimmy Choo. So let me give this a quick, oh, I just took the whole thing off. I thought this part comes off and it doesn't. The little sprayers right here. Oh my gosh. That was my bad. And I'm just spraying it in the box that it came in. This one I didn't love initially, which now I'm smelling and it reminds me of something from my childhood. But um, this one I initially did not love. I actually walked around the department store, kept smelling different fragrances, and then I smelt this little tester again and I was like, wait a minute. The dry down on this though is really beautiful. And I wasn't expecting that from this fragrance, but it really is very nice. Very nice date night, um, floral type perfume. Let's see what I smell. It's floral, but it's not, and it's not powdery. It might have a little bit of musk in it. Um, I don't have the notes, but I will put them on the screen and let me grab my other things. So we have Jo Malone. Isn't this bag so cute? I love their bags. It makes me so happy. And the rep over at Jo Malone was so, so sweet. And very patient and kind to me. So this is what the Mother's Day box looks like, or at least, well, it's not the Mother's Day box, but it's the summer collection box. And I just happen to choose the blue one. I think it's so beautiful. Let me take the ribbon off and I'll show you which two I got from Jo Malone. This was like a very much a surprise pickup. Well, all of these are really a surprise pickup, but I digress. So what I picked up was the Nashi Blossom. Um, in one of my other videos, I think it was my Sephora haul, um, I picked up the Red Hibiscus and that one just did not sit right on my skin. It's something about it was very smelly. It, it almost smelled like I was, 
I don't know, trying to cover something up or something to that effect. And I'm just gonna spray it on the paper that it came with. This one's so light and I don't know, it reminds me of like cucumbers and just fresh, very, very fresh. If you like fresh, you're gonna love this. And then the one that I chose from their summer collection is Tangy Rhubarb Cologne. And it comes in a jar like this. And out of all the ones that she sprayed, Roses also smells very good. I might go back and actually get that one. Um, but I actually didn't think about it when I was there. So this one, it just, that uh, like an undertone that smells so great to me. I just love, love, love it. Oh, and look how cute the little cap is. So those are the four fragrances that I got from Mother's Day. I definitely, definitely recommend at least um, you guys going into a department store and um, smelling these. These are some great choices for the summer. Um, really, I think these three are great summer perfumes. And then this one is a year round perfume. Um, I don't think that it's very offensive at all. So it's probably a good one to wear to work. Um, whereas the other ones, well, this one you could probably wear, get away with wearing to work as well because it's kind of light, um, but you only need like one spray. It lasted a good amount of time. This one did, this is the Nashi Blossom. And then this one is very good. I like this one. So my favorite probably though is the Unexpected Angel Nova. This is the star of the show, literally the star of the show. So I'm very happy with this purchase. I'm very happy with my Mother's Day. It was was perfect. So um, let me know what you guys got for Mother's Day and what do you think of these perfumes? Um, and what's one that you recommend to me? So I will see you in the comments. Talk to you in the comments. See you next time. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye, YouTube.